everyone and welcome back to my channel Bon Bon. Today I'm going to show you how to make this stunning Dalgona cake. It's coffee sponge with Dalgona frosting and Dalgona candy. If you're all about Dalgona, you're going to love this cake. So let's start by making our Dalgona candy. Get your tray ready by lining it with aluminium foil or butter paper. Then in a non-stick pan, add your sugar and melt it on low heat and stir with a wooden spoon. Make sure you don't overheat your sugar. Once all your sugar is melted, remove from heat and add in your baking soda and mix well. Then pour your candy mixture in your tray. Be very careful and don't touch it at this stage as sugar gets very hot and you can burn your fingers. Let this cool for about 30 minutes. And then you have your Dalgona candy which originated from South Korea. It is also known as honeycomb. It's sweet, it's crunchy. You can top it on so many desserts or eat it as it is. For now, let's set it aside and work on our coffee sponge. In a bowl, add your eggs and sugar and beat them until the egg gets pale and foamy. This generally takes 15 to 20 minutes with a hand beater, so you have to be patient or you can use a stand mixer once the eggs get foamy get your coffee ready by mixing it with some milk then start folding your flour in your eggs with a spatula be very gentle and don't over mix your eggs or you can end up knocking all the air that you just built by beating those eggs the sponge is very light and fluffy it's just eggs sugar flour and coffee once all your flour gets folded, add in your coffee and gently fold it in as well. Pour your batter equally between two 7 or 8 inch greased M9 cake pans. Tap to release any air bubbles and bake at 170 degrees Celsius for about 20 to 25 minutes. Once your sponges have baked, let them cool and make your Dalgona frosting by beating coffee, sugar and ice cold water. Keep whipping until you get light and silky Dalgona frosting. Look how gorgeous it is. Now let's assemble our cake. I am going to do 4 layers by carving each sponge into 2 with a serrated knife. Just put your knife in the middle of the sponge, keep it straight and keep moving in or you could skip this part. Now spread your gorgeous Dalgona frosting. And sprinkle some crushed Dalgona candy on top. Then place your sponge on top, then frosting, candy, then sponge, then frosting, candy and then the final sponge on top. Now coat your entire cake with a thin layer of frosting to lock in the cake crumbs and chill it for about 20 minutes. After 20 minutes of chilling, frost your cake with final coat and smooth it out all around and the edges as well. Then cover the entire lower edge with crushed candy and frost some dollops on top by using a 2D nozzle. And finally decorate with shards of your Dalgona candy. And you have your simple yet stunning Dalgona cake ready to be enjoyed.